This is a quick video to show you the comparison between a door panel that we have made uh, recently for a customer compared to his old one that he brought in. It's worth noting the old one is not the original one, but it just shows you what other people out there in terms of trimmers or manufacturers uh, find acceptable in terms of quality. Um, so this is the fully trimmed up one. It's for a Series 2 open two-seater Roadster. Um, we have manufactured using new blanks, cut on our in-house CNC machine. We've done this in leather cloth, which strictly speaking is the exact original material that Jaguar actually used for this as opposed to vinyl uh, at the request of the customer. And we've reused his chrome work here uh, to attach it down. Uh, it's worth noting as well, the slot size does vary between the cars. This is what we refer to as a 28 centimeter larger slot. Some of them on the series one and a half cars, they were 25.5 roughly. So this is the slightly larger version, by far the more common version. So as you can see, all of the relevant fixing holes for the armrest um, and the attaching to the car are all in place. Uh, handle, door release and window winders, etc. We also put a much larger flap around these edges here. That is done intentionally because when everything's said and done in the car, the door slightly overhangs at the front there. And so we put this here and it makes everything tie in with the trim effectively. So very neatly done there compared to what came in. Now, obviously <laughs> um, we realize it's a bit old, uh, et cetera, but still you can just see it's been, should we say bodged is the best way of putting it. Uh, they've used a quite thick vinyl material there. All the holes are very raggedy. And it's just overall not particularly nice, clean finish compared to what we offer here. So this is just showing you the expertise that we have uh, on site. We've been doing these for 40 years. We know exactly what we're up to with these bits and bobs. So don't leave it to chance. You might think you're saving a few quid here or there by getting an independent trimmer to do it or, or one that you found on eBay. But overall, it's a false economy because you're going to end up with problems or it just won't look very nice. So just bear that in mind and see our website for more details.